ఒక చీఫ్ ఎలక్షన్ ఆఫీసర్ వికాస్ రాజ్ మాట్లాడుతున్నారు లైవ్ చూద్దాం is an ongoing exercise we will continue to do this uh, uh, till the poll is over uh, some uh, data about the parliament constituencies two constituencies are uh, within one district four constituencies are spreading over two districts six constituencies are spreading over three districts four constituencies are spread over four districts and one constituency is spread over five districts the smallest constituency in terms of area is hyderabad the largest in terms of area is adilabad the smallest constituency in terms of number of electorate is mahbubabad and the largest is malkajgiri now coming to model code of conduct of course model code of conduct is a huge subject uh, this is the this is the uh, this is the total uh, volume of model code of conduct so i would request all the political parties to and the candidates to go through that so that they don't uh, uh, don't make mistakes on that just a few points i will emphasize upon small things like even how two wheelers are to be used that is also regulated when they are when they are taking part for electioneering or when they are forming a part of a rally that is also something that needs to be regulated how many flags they can carry what size of flags they can carry everything is regulated so na na me dwara nenu valaku koredi entante please go through that so that you don't make mistakes on that there is a total ban on use of official vehicle for campaigning electioneering or election related travel during elections regarding road shows because this is one of the most prevalent thing that happens during the election prior permission for road show shall be taken from the competent authority mostly it will be the returning officer or uh, uh, aros who will be giving these permissions in order to avoid inconvenience to general public as far as possible road show should be permitted only on holidays and during no peak hours on routes other than that have big hospitals trauma centers blood banks and heavily crowded markets endeavor should be basically to do like this and it should not cover more than half of the road and their balance half of the road should be uh, should be available for people to move convoy of vehicles should not be more than 10 vehicles anta kante ekku vehicles unte daniki gap maintain cheyali at least 100 meter ki gap maintain cheyali display of animals in road show is totally prohibited children particularly school children in uniform shall not take part in road shows election kosam uh, ratri 10 pm nunchi morning 6 am varaku loud speaker vaadaniki ledhu any such loud speakers which are found uh, to be uh, doing outside the prescribed hours shall be confiscated furthermore it should be ensured by the concerned authorities of state pollution control board that decibel of the sound level generated by loud speakers should not exceed permissible limits idi kodiga drishti lo pettukovali ante otherwise too much volume pettukoni andarni harass cheyakudu that is the basic idea of this so we have given instructions to the dos also and through them to the pollution control board people also to monitor these activities vehicles with loud speakers of course need permissions without permission unte seize cheyadam jarugutundi temporary campaign office of course candidates and political parties chaala varaku open chestaru kani daniki guidelines unnai atlanti place lo cheyavachu atlanti place lo cheyakudu atlanti campus lo cheyali daniki guidelines unnai adi kodiga chusukoni cheyali that's what my request to all the political parties and candidates is of course candidates are not there in the picture right now but they will be coming there are prohibitions on misuse of bulk 
ఎస్ఎంఎస్ఎస్ ఆబ్జెక్షనబుల్ ఎస్ఎంఎస్ ఏమైనా వస్తే ఎవరికు దాన్ని పోలీస్ అథారిటీస్ షుడ్ అడ్వర్టైజ్ స్పెషల్ మొబైల్ నంబర్ ఆన్ విచ్ ద రిసీవర్ ఆఫ్ సచ్ ఎస్ఎంఎస్ క్యాన్ ఫార్వర్డ్ ద సెట్ ఎస్ఎంఎస్ సో దాట్ యాక్షన్ క్యాన్ బి టేకన్ ఆన్ ద పీపుల్ హూ ఆర్ సెండింగ్ సచ్ ఆబ్జెక్షనబుల్ ఎస్ఎంఎస్ఎస్ the commission has laid down the following lot of guidelines tonight i am not going to go through all those guidelines has laid down guidelines to be observed in the manner of election related campaign by organizers and persons other than political parties and candidates ante of course political parties candidates chestaru kaani vere vaalu kuda vaalu kosam cheyali ante daniki kuda guidelines unnai andukane adi chusukoni evaraina chestaru ante cheyandi dai chesi nenu vaalaku kore di idi తర్వాత ఆఫ్ కోర్స్ లాట్ ఆఫ్ డీటెయిల్డ్ గైడ్ లైన్స్ ఆర్ దేర్ ఆన్ వాట్ వెహికల్స్ ఆర్ టు బి యూజ్ వాట్ షుడ్ నాట్ బి యూజ్ ఎస్ ఐ సెట్ ఎంసిసి ఈజ్ ఎ వాస్ట్ సబ్జెక్ట్ ఐ ఎమ్ నాట్ గోయింగ్ ఇన్ టు ఫుల్ డీటెయిల్స్ ఆఫ్ దాట్ సమ్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ పార్ట్స్ ఐ హెడ్ టాక్ అబౌట్ కమింగ్ టు ప్రీ సర్టిఫికేషన్ ఆఫ్ పొలిటికల్ అడ్వర్టీజ్మెంట్స్ అండ్ మానిటరింగ్ ఆఫ్ ద ఆఫ్ ద పెయిడ్ న్యూస్ mcc as i said mcmc are in place already at district and state level all political advertisements proposed to be issued on electronic media shall require pre certification from the concerned mcmc political advertisement in all electronic media tv channels cable networks radio including private fm channels cinema halls audio visual display in public places voice messages bulk sms over phone and social media and internet websites shall come within the purview of pre certification so commission request uh, requests all political parties candidates media to follow pre certification instructions social media by definition falls under the category of electronic media just a clarification thus all political advertisement on social media also falls under the purview of pre certification clarification that was uh, that has been there for quite some time but there was some lack of clarification clarity on this as per the prov provisions contained in commission's letter dated so and so political advertisements issued in e papers of any newspaper shall invariably require pre certification by the concerned committee so almost every paper nowadays has a e paper component therefore almost everything gets covered in that so just a clarification in that regard of course you are aware that uh, uh, that uh, mlc election uh, from mahbubnagar local authorities constituency also has been notified so uh, that process is going on the returning officer for that is district collector mahbubnagar there are 1439 uh, voters for that and uh, uh, 10 polling stations are there so preparations are on for that we will be we will be going as per the schedule uh, the returning officer for uh, secunderabad uh, by election constituency is going to be ceo secunderabad 251000 uh, approximately voters are there of course continuous updation is going on so we will we will have uh, uh, the exact number after the last date there will be about 111 polling station polling station locations for that and 233 232 polling stations okay this is uh, all from my side Uh, voters uh, even bjp candidate uh, who has been announced 
she also said there are a lot of bogus photos. So, in this case, how many bogus photos are there in the city? And where are the deleted numbers? Okay, let me take one or two more questions, then I can answer them. मैंने फर्स्ट पेज लो दिस कुनाम सर अठे इस सारे मरे फोर्थ पेज के लिए नहीं मंडा क्या नुच्चे मैंने ओपिनियन ले लिया था अठे क्लारिफिकेशन तो ले लिया था ये प्लस सर अठे फोर्थ पेज ना कार्तम काले तो प्लीज प्लीज रिपीट 2019 एमपी इलेक्शंस तेलंगाना लो फर्स्ट पेज लो जरिए सर सो इस सारे फोर्थ पेज जरूरत Okay, let me let me answer these then probably we can go for more questions.